Now children, before going to the sum, I will tell you something. I have seen most children make this mistake. Suppose the sum is subtract 6 from 10. What do children mostly do? 6 from 10. Subtract 6 from 10. 4. Now here though the answer is right, the method is wrong. They are going according to the sentence. 6 from 10 subtraction. No. It means from 10 you take away 6. So from 10 you should take away. You should subtract 6. So it is 10 minus 6, 4. So now you understood. Whatever number comes after from, that should be written first. Now you will understand the sum easily. What should be subtracted from minus 3 by 4 so as to get 5 by 6? So let us assume that x should be subtracted from minus 3 by 4. So x should be subtracted from minus 3 by 4. That means from minus 3 by 4 this has to be taken away. So from minus 3 by 4 x has to be subtracted so as to get that means the result should be 5 by 6. Now this is right hand side and this is left hand side. Now here you can see x is in negative sign. So we will shift this x towards the right hand side and make it positive and we will bring 5 by 6 towards the left hand side and make it negative. So minus 3 by 4 is in left side let it be as it is and 5 by 6 which is on right hand side which has a plus sign will become minus 5 by 6 equal to minus x when it goes to right hand side it will become plus x minus x becomes plus x. Now the LCM of 4 and 6 is 6. No, 4 and 6 LCM is 12. LCM is 12. So 4 3s are 12. That gives us minus 3 into 3 minus 9. And 6 2s are 12. Which gives us minus 5 into 10. Minus 5 into 2 minus 10 is equal to x. So if both are minus, that means we have to add. So minus 9 minus 10 will give you minus 19 by 12 is equal to x. That means minus 19 by 12 should be subtracted from minus 3 by 4 to get 5 by 6. Hope you understood children.